YouTube, if uh, you've clicked on this video, you're probably interested in how an Dell Inspiron 15 operates as far as gaming, especially the model that comes with the Intel HD graphics. I know in days of yore, if you're looking at a laptop with integrated graphics, it's not going to be a video game powerhouse. But uh, if you are a casual gamer, you don't care about uh, bleeding edge technology and, and ultra and fantastic settings. Uh, or say you're just looking for a complement to a desktop system of yours, I do want you to rest assured that the Intel HD Graphics 4400 chipset, um, I believe it's just built onto the uh, the Haswell Core i5 processor, but it'll get you going there. It does uh, support uh, 3D acceleration, and I have not had any problems with any games I've played with it. What you will witness here is about... 20 minutes or so uh, video game footage taken directly uh, from the uh, uh, using fraps from the laptop I didn't use a camera for any of this now keep in mind I did this so you can get the best picture possible so you can see exactly how the games perform it was at the cost of some hitching some of these games will have abnormal hitching and you can blame the fraps program for that hitching generally the frame rates stay the same with the exception of the random pausing, I have not had any of that with the games themselves. And uh, what you see here right now, uh, this is Bioshock Infinite. And then we're going to move on to the next series of games. Keep watching this. Uh, I just have a set of games there. If you have any questions as to which games these are, just leave a comment. I'll be happy to answer these for you. If you want to see the more general purpose review of this laptop, uh, I'll have a link right below this video and I'll go ahead and put an annotation right here. Have a great day if you like this, if you found it helpful as far as if it's going to work for you with video games, please like this video, share, subscribe, and have a great day. occurred at exactly 1.20 a.m. and zero seconds! Ah, Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ, Doc. You disintegrated Einstein. Calm down, Marty. I didn't disintegrate anything. The molecular structure of both Einstein and the car are completely intact. Welcome to New York, version 2.0. channeling energy from alien technology, running their entire global power grid off a single Ceph machine inside this dome. It can't be that simple. It really is, mate. You kill the power, you kill cell. The 
as simple as you like. No, the Alpha Sep showed me a vision. We've been through this before. There's got to be a connection somehow. Prophet, the aliens are gone. You finish them off yourself. Just a few waifs and strays left. No, there's something more. If we can just find a hint, somewhere here, a clue. Listen, while you were off hunting some super alien that didn't even exist, Cell were busy taking over the world. We need you back in the here and now, boss. We need you to help us stop Cell. There's more than your revolution going on here. You hadn't been here. No more. Not again. Mommy! No! Get away from her! Protect her. You're the only one. You'll know what to do. Won't you? Corvo. Reward us all. Look at what he's done. Yes, he's killed the Empress. What did you do with young Lady Emily, traitor? Her own one.
take a look at this. It's not my job to pick through other people's trash. Shooter put him up against the wall and blew his brains out. Hell of a way to go. Doesn't really matter how you go once you're gone. <laughs> Don't get all deep on me, Phelps. Another one! Ralph, there's something on the rooftop. How the hell did you see that? That's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Sweetie, hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I know it's a big change for all of us, but son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? Why are we stopping? Why do you think? End of the line. Let's go. Shouldn't keep the gods waiting for us. Uh. 
Wait, we're not rebels. Face your death with some courage, thief. You've got to tell them. We weren't with you. This is a mistake. Step towards the block when we call your name. One at a time. Empire loves their damn lists. Ulfric Stormcloak, Jarl of Windhelm. It has been an honor, Jarl Ulfric. Raylof of Riverwood. <laughs> no care of Rorikstad. No, I'm not a rebel! You can't do this! Halt! You're not gonna kill me! Archers! Anyone else feel like running? Wait. You there. Step forward. No warrior, sir. I must admit, I prefer to joust verbal. Finally! Traitors of the realm boil tar on the walls while you dally with the royal advisor. How may I assist you, sir? We mount an assault today, and you'll be at my side. Follow me, gentlemen. Let's not keep the traitors waiting. Sire, you said we were out of range. That was a ballista, Excellency. Its arms strengthened with bronze plates and strung with horsehair. It can propel heavy bolts up to a mile away. A deadly and very costly weapon. An experienced crew can cock and release two bolts each minute. Yet it has one flaw. Your Grace, please take cover. The recoil of the arms is so strong upon firing that the weapon shifts. It simply cannot hit the same spot twice. I had no idea your grace was a learned military engineer. I'm not. I gave the Baroness those ballistae two years ago for her birthday. Sire. What say you, Excellency, of men who live in spite of such wounds? And what say you, your grace, of soldiers who inflict them? Those who did this live no more. Master Geralt, I wish to converse with you once the storm of battle has subsided. Forgive me, Excellency, but I plan to leave the royal court as soon as possible. Might I know why? Too often they take me for someone I'm not. What do they call you, soldier? Wait. You served with me at Brenneran during our foray into the Pontar Valley. Seder. Still an arbalist? Yes, sir. Fight has not been kind to me. Ha! <laughs> 
Norman Sador, for your years of faithful service to the Crown, I appoint you Decurion of the Arbalists. Onwards, gentlemen. No reason to dawdle. <laughs> <laughs>